This channel is supported by Truefire. Truefire is an online library of lessons from some of my favorite players. There's thousands of lessons on there. You can use the promo code JNC40 to get 40% off of any of their courses. <laughs> Welcome to the channel. If you've not been here before, I do quite a lot of different stuff on this channel. Some of it teaching. Mondays, I try and do some sort of lick-based thing. In the last week, I, I saw a cover that I'd put up um, of Never Too Much, and it jumped out to me, this little lick, which is really simple, but I think quite effective. So I wanted to show that to you, and um, the tab for this will go up on Patreon. If you're not up on my Patreon page, I try to keep it as cheap as possible so that hopefully quite a few of you can get some use out of it there is a two pound tier on there for people who you know can't afford to do whatever else and the idea is that you get everything for that whatever you pay so two pound a month if you want all my backing tracks and lessons and all that sort of stuff super appreciated if you do join up there anyway so the idea this is going to be pentatonic based as often is the case with some of these runs that I do. Normally though, I do kind of ascending bass stuff. Let me just uh, turn on a gate here because last time I didn't do that, it was a noisy affair. Something like Wayne Rooney in a retirement home. Anyway, right, so we're gonna go. Often my ascending stuff, I go up in uh, sort of six. <laughs> Today, what I thought was let's do something descending in sixes. I think this is a really good way to practice the pentatonic scale in all positions anyway. So the, the main thing that I jumped out at me that I had done, we're gonna go in the B minor pentatonic box shape, which you're totally used to doing. Then we jump back up a string. So we get 10-7, 10-7, nine seven and then back up ten seven nine seven nine seven nine seven nine seven nine seven and then you can kind of end it in a few ways so one way that i like to end it is that kind of eric johnson jump or jump down to your next shape. Talk about how I pick this. Um, there's, there's an alternate picking option. So if you slant downwards for this, then just alternate pick the whole thing. The way that I found that I was doing it in the past though was so down, up, up, down, wait, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, up, like that. So you get. Up. 
kind of this really nice rolling effect. It might take a bit of practice to get that under your fingers. Um, it feels still, even for me, like all these years later, kind of unnatural in a way. Um, we're going to be pulling off for most of that as well. Anyway, so that's kind of one. It's going to work really nicely with lots of gain as well. Um, the other next thing to do, obviously, from there is to take your other positions. And then... Like that. There's one, another here. Okay, another here. And then one more here. Yeah. And what you find is that all of these kind of shapes give you something else to kind of contend with. Um, the Patreon will have the tab for all of those, but slower. slower than that I'm going to lose battery then the next thing that I would really encourage you to try is switching box shapes as you go time that I'm playing my descending six I'm shifting up to the next box shape I initially heard Guthrie Govan doing this or swore him teaching this in a lesson hey has a really cool sound So those are the ideas to watch out for. I'm going to try and build some of that into some of my improvisation this week. Um, give that a try. I think those are some really cool sounding licks. Just something that I was reminded of. Really, really simple ideas, but I think they sound quite effective. can try shifting down as well those boxes feel free to like and subscribe if that was at all useful to you i hope it was for someone um for me i like to have something to sort of um sink a grappling hook into in the start of the week so that i can try and remember some sort of concept that i want to try and practice cheers